It has been serving families for 28 years, and there's no sign of slowing down. If you go visit Radicky's Blue Bonnet Grill, you're most likely going to taste the spicy flavor of jalapeno. Eric Hernandez and photojournalist Tim Stewart visited the place in this week's Flavor Faves. We do chicken fried steak. Today we have meatloaf, and everything is homemade. Opened by David Radicky, Radicky's Blue Bonnet Grill is home to many on the east side, especially Janie Agus. Janie has been working at the Blue Bonnet Grill almost all 28 years it's been open. Just three years ago, David retired and handed the place over to Janie. He said, Janie, keep it the way we've done it all this time and stuff. And we have. Since taking over, Janie hasn't changed much, but did add a few more jalapeno inspired menu items. Radicky's is famous for its jalapeno fried chicken, but that special jalapeno recipe can also be found in its fish, pork chops, even its macaroni and cheese. David Radicky created the jalapeno recipe, and soon everyone fell in love with it. So, what's behind that famous chicken? I think because we make it with love. Our jalapeno chicken, we marinate it overnight so, like that, it can be nice and spicy. It's not like Super spicy, you know, but it, enough where it'll hit you. Despite the spice, the place is always busy, and you can always find a regular customer around to chat with. It's good home cooking. They have plate lunches, you, a variety of different items that you can order. It's just plain good food. No matter how many times one visits, you can always count on great service and the same recipes being used that made the place famous. Anything that we're going to make is going to have some kind of jalapeno, some kind of spice. You know, it's going to stick to what it began with. Erica Hernandez, KSAT 12 News. Well, if you want to visit us, if you want us to visit one of your favorite places in town, send an email to flavorfaves at ksat.com or leave us a Facebook comment. It's a tough job, but somebody's got to do it. Somebody's got to do it. You know, I was wishing they would bring back some of that mac and cheese. Now I'm hungry. Sounds good. <laughs>